blessed are you, Lord God of all creation, for through your goodness we have this wine to offer. Fruit of the vine and work of human hands will become our spiritual drink. Blessed be God forever. The park really gets you in touch with reality. Uh, we are sitting on the biggest volcano on Earth. Uh, the beauty, the majesty, I mean, just the, the sheer reality of nature here. And I think when we get in touch with reality, we get in touch with God. And when we get in touch with God, we and the world transform. You just ride around here and it's, it's majestic, it's awesome. It's amazing that this country had the foresight to protect these areas and preserve these areas and make them available for the whole world. We are in the canyon section of Yellowstone National Park, uh, where we have the evening Saturday mass every uh, Saturday night in the summer. And tomorrow morning, there'll be a mass in the Old Faithful area and then another in Lake area. Yellowstone National Park is huge. People really don't realize how big it really is. Where's everybody from? Michigan in the house, I saw that. Uh, mass here, you'll see often people from other countries, uh, people from all over the country here. And it's all been just preserved for us. Obviously, people who are coming to Mass in the park are making an effort. Um, I'll often have extra consecrated hosts because oftentimes a family will fly in because they got caught in a buffalo jam or something, and at least they can receive communion. Um, and I think it's an experience of God unlike any other. Uh, we sing America the Beautiful, and as I often say, you know, you sing it here like you'll sing it nowhere else. It's a real privilege to be able to celebrate the Eucharist with people here in the park. Oh, yeah.